welcome back all of you myself like rehman today we are going to study a topic threats to biodiversity in that we will study habitat loss first, which causes due to deforestation and pollution mainly so there are different threats to biodiversity such as habitat destruction it it is very important to protect habitat in order to protect biodiversity within it huge pressure from the world's rapidly increasing population has led to the destruction of habitat global climate change change in biotic elements of ecosystem leads to biotic change also next is habitat fragmentation it occurs due to human activity and reduces the ability of habitat to support species of organisms next is pollution introduction of pollutants such as nutrient overloading with nitrate fertilizers as well as more immediately harmful chemicals leads to pollution which is a major threat to biodiversity Next is over exploitation this includes the illegal wildlife trade as well as overfishing or logging of tropical hardwoods etc and alien species what are these alien species it is introduced by humans to regions where they are not no natural predators and diseases is also one of the cause which create threats to biodiversity it leads to reduction in habitat causing high population densities encourages spread of different kinds of diseases in this diagram you can see the animal or organism has nowhere to hide due to habitat loss different climatic condition extreme weather condition so this is a major threat to biodiversity the example is of rhinoceros of sumatra an indian species of cheetah they have been extinct the major reason is also due to extreme hunting to the point of extinction and also the extreme conditions climatic conditions recently cheetah have been introduced back to india which has been transported or airlifted from namibia habitat loss is caused due to deforestation and pollutions deforestation mainly due to extreme cutting of trees or logging of the woods causes large deforestation or overgrazing etc pollution example such as harmful toxic chemicals effluent which have been released from industries and factories direct into the aquatic bodies leads to dif difficulty to the aquatic animals or organisms that causes harm to aquatic life heavy metal pollution is also one of the example which is uh, getting accumulated more and more in the soil which leads to the soil to lose its fertility and another is acid rain effect the harmful rains which is caused due to the pollution it affects the uh, aquatic animals also and the infrastructure building also you can see here the deforestation the entire forest has been cut down for construction purposes or for logging of woods and other various purposes so habitat loss can be described when an animal loses their home every animal in the animal kingdom has a niche they are in animal community and without their habitat they no longer have a niche what are the reasons of habitat loss it may be due to humans and it can be natural also we'll see how 
reasons of habitat loss by humans, extensive agriculture or farming, and harvesting natural resources for personal use, and for industrial and urbanization development. Habitat destruction is currently ranked as the primary consumer of species extinction worldwide. Example of it, the impact upon China's panda once found across the nation, now it's only found in fragmented and isolated regions in southwest of the country as a result of widespread deforestation which occurred in 20th century. Now these are due to human causes, but there are natural causes too. Habitat destruction through natural processes such as volcanism, fire, climate change is well documented in the fossil record. One study shows that fragmentation of tropical rainforest in Euro about 3000 million years ago lead to great loss of amphibian diversity. You can see the fire, forest fire causes deforestation or extreme flooding and environmental issues which that also causes the deforestation. Now students, what are the solutions for this? Protecting or remaining intact section of natural habitat is very important. Human population should be controlled and expansion of urbanization in industries in forest lands should be controlled. We have to educate the public about the importance of natural habitat and its biodiversity. Solution to habitat loss can include planting trees also, planting home gardens so as to reduce need for man to need large lands for agriculture farms which may lead to habitat loss also. So students, I hope you all must have understood what is habitat loss. Thank you.